Hello guys, in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to fix Palworld black screen on startup and after the launches it will go to black screen and nothing happens. So I'm gonna fix this issue. So first of all, you guys have to delete your cache memory from your computer. So in order to do that, you're gonna have to press Windows plus R button together from your keyboard or right click on the start button and go to run or you guys can search on search bar and type run and open this app and now you guys have to press T E M P and press ok Control plus A to select all the files in it and press delete on your keyboard and delete all the files in it there must be so many files in your computer because I deleted recently so that's why there are some files less files so skip all the files that cannot be deleted that's it and again open run and type percentage sign before and after the temp like this also delete all the files in it and skip the file that cannot be deleted now you guys have to reopen run and type prefetch E R E F E T C H Control plus A and delete them all. Just like that. Simple and easy. Now you guys have to empty your recycle bin completely. So all the trash files are gone. And this is the safe. Nothing important file will be deleted. Now after that, you're gonna have to download this spell world fix raw file. Link given in the description. There are some ads on the website, yes. Stay on the website link and don't open any, go to any pop-up, just close all the pop-ups ads. The download link will be open on the same page which is given in the description and will be the Google Drive link. After downloading it, just simply right click on it and click on extract here. Open this spell belt fix folder and you will see three fold files here. First of all, DirectX properties. DirectX update. These both are from Microsoft officially. Open the first one. Open dxcpl.exe file. You guys can see the company Microsoft Corporation. Open it. You will see this interface here. You're gonna have to click on this edit list and remove all the clear all the list and you're gonna have to click on three dots and go to stream you're gonna have to select your stream so wherever you have installed just go to that folder and open steam i'm gonna find my steam where i have installed You're gonna have to select this team.exe file application click open click add click ok now you're gonna have to select force WP, WARP and disable feature level upgrade check these two boxes click on apply click ok and that's it now go back and open DirectX update this is a web DirectX web setup for from Microsoft. I'm gonna have to click I accept the agreement and check this box. Click next, and this will install the latest DirectX version which is available. And most of these errors and crashes occurs because of DirectX version is old. So it's a compulsory step. You guys have to do this. Click on finish. Now go back, open the CMD commands. There are some commands you're gonna have to paste in CMD. Type CMD and right click on it and click on run as administrator. Copy the first command, paste in CMD, press enter, and the ultimate performance is activated. Now you guys have to copy the last three commands, paste in here click enter that's it 
a reboot is required for the, for this to take effect now press exit press enter that's it now you guys all you have to do is restart your pc and run bell world and if you still see black screen just stay there for 10 minutes set the timer and stay for 10 minutes and it will be running like smoothly thanks for watching hope this video helps you make sure to subscribe and like the video see you in the next video bye guys